So, what's up, guys? Today, on June 26, 2016, there was a clash at the state capitol in Sacramento, California, when a group of white supremacists and neo-Nazis showed up on the capitol grounds for their march, for a planned march. According to eyewitnesses and the local CHP that patrols the Capitol Museum grounds, seven people were stabbed, up to even ten people were actually, um, were even stabbed and injured, um, and there's a little, there's very little to go on because this is still developing and everything like that, but there are reports that at least a few uh, neo-Nazis were injured in the attacks as well as a violence uh, that was unleashed upon the uh, that was unleashed upon uh, upon the counter protesters at the state capitol. I really don't see what what this group what this group the traditional workers uh, party, which I find hilarious that they're called a traditionalist workers party, when they obviously don't represent workers, they represent a a, a hate-fueled group of, of individuals spouting anti-Semitism, anti, you know, anti-Islam, you know, spouting, you know, hateful rhetoric. And it's like, what did they expect that was going to happen? You know, yes, this is a, in California can be a peaceful place, but when you're a neo-Nazi group showing up to the Capitol grounds, in a place that's pre in a state predominantly known for its liberal and even, you know, e even socialist uh, groupings of people, what did you think was going to happen? And of course, I think it's funny how the right wing is defending the attacks, but not surprising, because the, trying to say that oh it was the counter protesters that attacked first that oh that, you know look at these you know liberals that you know who talk about being so peaceful and blah 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 and that could be further from the truth the violence starts because a bunch of neo nazis decide you know oh well, we don't like what you said you know what takes out a, a shank and stabs somebody cuz that's what happens so, I mean, that, that's just the nature of the far right. The far right is known for being militant and having a propensity towards aggression and violence. That's kind of what, you know, the whole far right ideology. That's kind of the whole idealism, you know, of people like that. So... Frankly, to the people that were the counter protesters that were injured today, um, my my hearts go out to you. My hearts my, my heart go my uh, heart goes out to the families of the vi of the victims of the the counter protest victims that were injured today. As far as the group of neo Nazi white supremacist thugs that were protesting at the Capitol today and brought that violence, you know, upon th that, th upon those grounds, all I can say is d 